I just typed Let's Go Ibui as the name of that last episode. Hey, do you know what catch combos are? If you keep catching the same species of Pokemon over and over, you'll have a better chance of meeting a really strong one. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Go Eevee, episode number 39? 40. 40. Episode 40? My god. Oi. Training on a romantic... Uh, training on a romantic bridge where you can smell the sea breeze doubles the effects of the training. Let's do some coaching. Are you ready? Let a, po let a Pokemon battle begin, yo. Really? <laughs> yo? Coach Trainer Priya. She's probably going to be easy just because of how high level I am compared to this area. Even though she is a coach. Okay. Well, maybe they like level with you actually because uh, level 38 Pokemon. I wonder, do coach trainers level with you then? Because yeah, I mean everybody else has been under level 30 here. So that seems strange that she would be so high level. And every coach trainer I've seen has always been around my level. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, I guess it means that, like, if you come back and fight them later, they won't be any easier than if you fight them now because they'll be the same level as you. So, I mean, I guess that's a cool mechanic. Now, oh, if I wake up Pikachu, he's just going to fall right back to sleep. Dream Eater. Ow. That actually hurt a lot. Yay, Pikachu woke up. So I didn't even know Butterfree could learn Dream Eater. My god. I guess it makes sense. Eevee does, or Butterfree does learn a lot of psychic moves. So I guess it would make sense. Let's send out Clefable. Mascot versus mascot? Because Clefairy was originally going to be the mascot of Pokemon. And then they changed it to uh, Pikachu. And now it's sort of Pikachu and Eevee. So, mascot versus mascot. Double kick! Ah, stupid Clefables. Curse of the Clefable. It returns. <laughs> uh. Remember my playthrough of Pokemon Moon? Where it took me like 20 minutes just to beat. Hey, cool. And a crit. Cool. Yay. Go Eevee. But like, it took me 20 minutes to beat Lusamine's freaking Clefable. Because it had just boosted its stats so much. And like, Clefables are ridiculously hard to kill to begin with. And then it had boosted all of its stats all the way to the max. Like, all of its stats. Attack, defense, special attack, special defense. Everything had gotten boosted all the way to the max. I was just like, oh my god! I finally took it down when I freaking... It lost that boost for one turn. That's a romantic battle. Here, a token of my gratitude. I got Dream Eater. Cool. TM59 holds the move Dream Eater. It only works on Pokemon that are asleep, but I assure you its effect is devastating. I noticed. <laughs> it hurt. A lot. What is this way, I wonder? Stop down. Oh, this is just the, uh, the wild Pokemon area. Got it. Um, I mean, I don't really need to catch any Pokemon. 
aside from like leveling and experience and candies so but I'll give it a sh I'll catch at least one in, in here I mean, I do need experience, so... And catching Pokemon does earn you experience. It's mostly just checking to see if there was anything in here. Oh yeah! Max Lore! How about that? Wait! I don't know what it... Ow! I walked into the Pidgey. Really? Why are you... <laughs> oh my god, I hate this game sometimes. Literally every one of those throws was thrown exactly the same way. And you saw each throw was vastly different from the previous. Oh my god, get in the stupid ball! They really don't need you, but I don't care. Yes! What? Really? Just get in the thinking ball. I hate it. I hate it so much. Oh my god, get in the ball, you stupid Pokemon. I'm still throwing the Pokeball exactly the same way, by the way. I haven't changed how I've been throwing the ball. And the Pidgey right away, of course. After making me waste all those Pokeballs, Pidgey got bored and ran away. Well, I wonder, like, you know, so the, the Master Ball, there's only one of it, right? And considering the game mechanics of this game, like, could I just throw the Master Ball and just fail? And just lose the Master Ball just because of that? I guess it would be pretty reminiscent of Generation 1. Because in the original Generation 1 games, every Pokeball, you know, like there was always a chance of literally just missing the Pokemon. Even the Master Ball. Not like failing to catch it, but like just straight up you threw it, and it would literally say, you missed the Pokemon, you know? It was something that was only ever in the first gen games. And never in anything else. And I only ever encountered it like once. But it was a thing that could happen. Even with the Master Ball. I never had it happen with the Master Ball. But it could happen with the Master Ball. So. Um, okay. So to get there is all the way up there. Alright. Well let's fight these two. I told him I'm good for a kid. Well that's good. I mean, you are the equivalent of a Girl Scout in this game, so... I would hope so. I mean, my nephew is a girl Boy Scout, and he's not the nicest person. Not the good, you know, goodest person. But... I would hope that the, you know, Boy Scouts, Girl Scouts and such are... You know, not, like, they're not going to be the, the force that instills goodness into your children. But I would hope that they help with that. And I would hope that, you know, parents would be raising their children well enough to, you know, have good kids. You know, not letting their kids raise themselves because that they're never around. 
course, in this day and age, a lot of the time, parents aren't around just because they have to work. Because everybody has to work these days. Everybody has to work two jobs these days. It's, getting, it's ridiculous. It really is. So Sarka wants to learn Hydro Pump. Eh. I would learn Hydro Pump, but it's such a low hit rate. And it's only got five power points. I'm not even going to bother. I really wish there was an Everstone in this game, though. So I didn't have to keep telling the game, no, I don't want it to evolve. I just be like, give it the Everstone so it doesn't evolve. I gave my Pokemon a quick candy. Although I did have a viewer on Twitch.tv back when I was streaming there regularly. And it was really funny because you got um you know the they you know, his name was Charmander and I, mean, I know his real name now but I'm not even paying attention but like he, he went by Charmander and we always joked it was like well you know you're going to be turning 16 soon so then you're going to evolve and of course he kept the name Charmander even after he turned 16 and so we we're like, when are you going to evolve? It's like, I got Everstone's disease. <laughs> it was funny. I always made a joke out of the fact that he had Everstone's because even though he was, you know, over level 16, he hadn't evolved yet. So. And he was the one that initiated the joke, so we weren't making fun of him. Yeah, that was, he was the one that came up with it initially. And we all just kind of piggybacked off the joke because of that. So. I don't see him around much anymore, though. He's in my Discord channel. By the way, there is a link in the description to my Discord channel if you want to stop by and come chat with me and some of my friends and other viewers like you. One of my PBS. <laughs> this PlayStation this station supported by viewers like you. I mean, really, that is what YouTube is. Oh, too bad. I just messed up. Like, it is literally is viewers like you that are what support us. So, no, north to Silence Bridge, huh? All right. So now this is the fence maze area. I do remember this place in the original game. Let's see. Uh, I have no idea what I was just let seeing about, actually. Because I have no reason to let's see. Let's just, let's fight. Make you Pokemon wish to make your acquaintance. I just realized we did not actually get a bike on this game, did we? We never did get a bike. Like, usually you get down here, and at this point, you know, you're going through this area on a bike on other, in the, like, the Gen 1 games. But yeah, I just realized, we never did get a bike. I don't think there is one. Hmm. Yeah, well, whatever. I mean, if there's a way to get a bike, I don't know it, so... Oh, you done messed up! Send out Golduck! You done messed up! Boom! Oh, wow. Still alive. 
I actually figured it would go down pretty quickly because it's a gold duck, so it would have higher special defense than it does regular defense. And, you know, water type, so two times damage. But, nah. I act it actually did not go down that quickly. Ugh. I, like, I don't know why this just popped into my head, but I really want to play World of Warcraft right now, and I can't afford it. I don't know why that just, like, popped into my head. I know that, uh, Classic comes out in August, and if I can uh, find a way to afford that, I am definitely going to be playing that. Because I loved World of Warcraft Classic. Maybe I'll even do a series on it. Wow, your badges are too cool. I have to just look up what all it takes to be able to play Warcraft Classic. Like, is it you just if you're if you have an active WoW description, does it automatically allow you to play Classic? You know, I actually don't know. I guess we'll find out when it comes out in August. I'll have to look at it at that point. And if I, uh, if I can, I'll probably do a full World of Warcraft Classic series, because that would be a lot of fun. I'd love to do that. Mostly because I never did get all the way through Classic when I played it before. Like, I never hit level, 50, level 60. I didn't hit 60 until um, Burning Crusade came out. So I'm pretty excited about that. I do want to hit level 60 before they put out World of Warcraft Classic The Burning Crusade. So, which from what I understand is their plan, um, like they're releasing all of the World of Warcraft Classic stuff, and then if that does well, then they'll look into like Burning Crusade and Wrath of the Lich King. And that would be fun. So, I'd love to replay through all that. Hehe, <laughs> you got stuck. Trainer tips. Sort the items in your bag using the Y button. Filter your TMs too, it's really handy. Actually, I probably should do that. Sort items by name. By type. Because, oops. I guess that's how they were already sorted. But maybe not. Maybe there were... No, because there were some some of these that were in different areas. What the heck is a silver leaf? Serious silver leaf. No trees with this leaf have been found yet. Hmm. A nugget. Card key. SS ticket. I'm curious what the autograph is for. It's definitely going to be for something, but I don't know what. Get wrecked, poor. Get wrecked, eradicate. We. I just like walk down here. Yeah, I didn't want to fight him immediately, so I will fight him. Don't get me wrong. I just didn't want to do it right away. You know. Hi. We've been bad. Bing. That said, I'm noticing that it is becoming more and more difficult to catch Pokemon. Like the ring is getting dark, you know, more and more dark red. Even with Great Balls, they're like dark red now, so. It's like, oi! Yay! One more level for Redicate. And we can go back up and do Saffron City Gem. I told you we'd get Saffron, get to Saffron City Gem at some point. Have a battle with me in this hidden place. It's not really all that hidden. It was just behind a bush. Graveler, huh? Alright, Venusoid. 
Oh wow, those Pokemon are actually pretty decently leveled in this area I just noticed. Let's start it off with some Leech Seed. So I can sit here and keep getting health back every round. That's an Earthquake. But that's a Leech Seed. Leveler's health was sapped by Leech Seed. And Vine Whip. Mostly I, mostly I just don't want to use Mega Drain right away. Stealth Rock. Ugh. Oh well, whatever. I only have to worry about if I switch Pokemon. If he keeps up using Pokemon that I can beat down with a grass type, I'll be fine. What do you want, phone? Twitter notifications. Ooh, Magneton. Which I think is alright, though. Um, Vine Whip. See how well that does. Not very well, honestly. That's unfortunate. Paralysis. Um, Mega Drain? I don't, I didn't catch whether it was... Like, not very effective, or... Okay, I wondered, just because it's part steel type. Did I click on the wrong thing? I did. Um... I mean, I really just can't do anything here, so I'll just take a little bit of damage. It's not a big deal. Hmm. Oi! Let's drop my, uh... Oh my god, people! Shut up! <laughs> Twitter is... My Twitter is so ridiculously active, it can be annoying funny because I don't post like anything to Twitter but like so, okay some of the people that I follow just like post 50,000 times a day so I'm just sitting here like do 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 ding 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 it's like oh my god oh my god please stop Ugh. oh yeah, yeah. uh Hyper Fang? Mm. God dang it, you and your stupid Thunder Wave. Eh. Hate it. This guy's actually put up quite a fight here. It's slightly annoying, to be honest. It's like there was a huge jump in difficulty all of a sudden. Like I passed that Snorlax and just all of a sudden it was just like, okay, huge jump in difficulty time. It's like, uh Hunter! 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 Dark Pulse. It's not very effective. And I flinched, of course. And of course, there's every chance that not only will I flinch, but then if I don't flinch, it'll be freaking paralysis that does me in. All I had to do is hit one once with a dark move, though. Get wrecked. <sighs> I lost. No one was watching us, right? Only, like, three people. 
because I don't really get that many people watching me all that often, so. No, not really. <laughs> well, now watch as this one video gets like a thousand views. Bye bye, Anne. Won't have any effect. Good, because I wasn't even trying to do that. I just misclicked. Use some super potion. Like so. And then some full heals. Because full heals are a lifesaver. Alright. Well, I think we can go ahead and end this episode here. So I do hope you've enjoyed. If you have, feel free to subscribe. Check the video description down below for a link to the playlist. So you can get caught up on any episodes you might have missed. And with that, I'll see you all next time. See you later.